Good morning. <laughs> now I know there's a title over there with my name. It's my Why Quanny Why. Don't question me. Question yourself. Quanny not going live 50, 11 times a day. And everybody got damn beers and starting no bullshit. Quanny has not paid for folks Zooms. And then coming live talking about I got secrets. I want to tell y'all what's going on. Quanny not in everybody's business. You know why Quanny not in everybody's business? Quanny got her own business. That's why. Question yourself. I'm telling you this to save your life, not to save mine. My life is intact. I'm not a busybody. I'm not trying to fit in with everybody. I don't need to belong. You know why? I already belong. Read. This is not about you. This is about your children. More so, Makai. Your other son already adult. Girl, please. Girl, if you don't back up. Now, your head get knocked off. Don't get mad and don't say, I didn't warn you. Now, your ass is on YouTube crying about the tea lounge had somebody stalking you. You said that, not Kwani. Quanny not being stalked. Quanny ain't got no photographs of somebody photographing her and throwing her up on YouTube and crying on YouTube about it. You do. Now you done got beside yourself on here. Talk about why Quanny, why? No, question yourself. For you to be as old as you are, who needs to belong in groups? Who needs to belong in a category? If your ass get fucked up in the game, get locked up, get murdered, these hoes don't give a fuck about you. You think YouTube content creators, subscribers, your moderator is going to put money somewhere? Hell no. They're going to laugh at you and say that's what you get because you're stupid. Call up thing to thing, girl. This folks don't give a fuck about you, girl. You ain't nothing but a YouTuber. Going nowhere slowly. Not nowhere fast, but nowhere slowly. Girl, please. You silly. She know everything about everybody, but don't know nothing about autism. She know everything about everybody on YouTube, but don't know how to solve autism in her house. Now, let's get real on that. So, what she going to say? I'm talking about her son. No, you put all your business on YouTube. You know everything about everybody, but not about autism. But Makai over there on, wait, what he was on? What you complained about the other day? Weren't you over there bragging and laughing and fighting? It was so funny that he was over there on Instagram stalking his friends. And you kept telling him not to do that. It was creepy. He kept saying he didn't understand. Mom, I don't understand. Why can't I ask the girls what they doing every two seconds? No, Makai, that's creepy. You put that on YouTube, honey. How do I know that information? Because of you. By way of you. Talking about the folks in your family by way of you. That your grandmother and your mama them got you going to look, going to view bodies, deceased folks, because they can't go. They got you and your cousins doing it. Wait a minute, you put that on YouTube by way of you. I find it quite odd if you ask me. I don't know about no family that does that. My family ain't never done no bullshit like that. Got me going looking at deceased dead folks because they can't make the funeral. I ain't got no child with autism and over here uh, on Instagram uh, stalking other folks in classrooms. I don't know shit about that. That ain't my life. And if it was my life, I wouldn't be on YouTube telling it. It's just some shit you just don't put on here. And then cry when somebody uses it against you. No, don't question quantity. Question you. You start writing books. You start writing books because you want to fit in with folks. What happened to your books? 
It looked like to me, Timothy Blaney wrote two extra books over your one from the beefing set tour. Timothy Blaney took over of the book writing in the beefing set tour. No, don't get mad at me. Don't ask me no damn quant why, quanty, why, no. Why you question yourself? Why are you kissing ass of folks who don't give a fuck about you, who never liked you? They only like it you're now because look who you're riding with and look who you're rocking with. You think Sean Bradley really care about you, girl? Really, girl? You think Susie really like you, really? Girl, please. Why they didn't like you before? What you heard before? Why didn't they like you before? Do tell. You were here, you were here before. Now, why aren't you? Aren't you considered an OG as well? Weren't you here before? Oh, now they, uh, everybody's so forgiving, aren't they? They're so forgiving, really. Mm. Yeah, they're forgiving because they can use you. Now you're able to be utilized now. That's why they like you now. They're able to utilize you now. <laughs> well, nobody liking your ass, your ass over there writing that goddamn book. Nah, did they? They all despised you, didn't they? When they calling you horrible names? Now nah, everybody just so in love with Reed. Really now? They love her. Really? No. You just able to be used. They don't have to go live as much anymore because they got you going live. Call a thing a thing, Reed. And just say you enjoy being used by them. No, don't say no, why, Kwani, why? Question yourself that they using you. And they ain't got to use themselves anymore. Because your ass out here on the streets. Riding dirty. Riding dirty for them. And they laughing at you. Saying, well, we ain't got to go lie. Let that dummy do it. Look at her. Go ahead, roll runner. Go ahead, roll runner. You roll runner and wild E. Coyote rolled into one. Don't question my integrity. Question yours being used. But they didn't ask you to be used. They didn't ask to use you. You chose to utilize your own self, Reed. Let's get real on that. You chose to be used. You chose to lay there and, and on your own sword. So you can fit in. Oh, that's, isn't that why you paying for all these Zooms? Aren't you in everybody's Zoom meeting? You know everything about Kimmy Zoom. You know why you know everything about Kimmy Zoom? Because you paid for it. Mm. And that's some shit. Who pays for something they can't stand? But a fool. What the fuck do I like paying for motherfucker Zoom meetings? Or Instagrams and all that bullshit you in? All these memberships you didn't pay for. But don't like none of them. But a goddamn fool. You so damn nosy. You can't even pronounce nosy. It's called nosy, not newsy. She pronounced nosy, newsy. There ain't no Philadelphia thing. It's just a language barrier. It's called nosy, not newsy. All up in everybody's business, but can't pronounce words. My God, today. <laughs> don't even have the English language correct. No, don't talk about no why quantity. No, question yourself why you're utilizing yourself and why you're spreading yourself so thinly. You ought to be over there solving real issues, like finding the reason for autism. But cry when somebody calling your child horrible names. And y'all over there calling my child retarded. Find a cure. You can't find a cure because you're too busy on YouTube trying your best to fit in with folks who don't give a fuck about you. Who laughing at you. Even the ones with autistic children. But they made a way for theirs. They went on YouTube 50, 11 times a day and all that bullshit. They're not on YouTube telling all they got them autistic business of their children either. 
I ain't big more her as soon as go live and start talking about what her son over there doing. That her son was over there doing X, Y, and Z. I ain't big more her to say anything about that. Now, if she is over there telling them stories, I miss those. Unless she telling them over there somewhere else. I don't follow her over there. I'm not following a bitch all around the world and y'all, y'all trying my best to fit in no goddamn world, bitch. I stay right over here on YouTube. Hear what I hear and go about what I go about. So no, don't question my integ integrity. Question yours. How about this lack of integrity that you do not have? Now all of a sudden you hate all these folks on YouTube. Yeah, by way of hating because other folks don't like them. What have these folks done to you? What has Jess Kimmy did to you? What has Joyce done to you? No, Joyce ain't done none of you, and Kimmy ain't done none of you. No, you hate them by way of others. You don't like them by way of others. But if they open their motherfucking doors and let you in, your ass will be over there. If you hate Kimmy so much, why are you paying for her membership? It makes you a fool. Why are you going into that woman membership you can't stand her? It don't make Kimmy look stupid. It make you look stupid. That's why Sean lets everybody in. Sean says what? What is Sean saying over there for his memberships? He don't give a goddamn who over there. As long as he getting that money. He know folks are stupid enough to buy. He know folks are dumb enough to buy. That's why that model he got over there. Now, don't question me, question you. I'm not buying no bitch membership on no motherfucking YouTube. I don't care enough. I'm not nosy enough. Not newsy. I'm not nosy enough. I don't give a fuck. You show up here, you're going to die. Now, that's my motto. I'm going to peel your cap back. You walk up here standing, you're going to leave her laying. Feet in position, on your back, on your front, on your side. Who cares? So no, don't question me. Question you, kissing ass, Reed. I ain't got time for that bullshit show that talk. Fuck up. Her ass kissing ass. And y'all know it. She know everything, but she don't know about how to solve autism in her house. She know everything, but don't know how to solve autism in her house. Your job is to grow your son up because your ass going to end up gone to glory and who going to raise him? You don't understand autism very well, girl. Can Makai make it without you? Can Makai live on this planet Earth without your ass? Read. If you die today, can Makai make it? Who going to take care of Makai? When your ass in the grave, who gonna take her out of girl? He your son. He not your son's son. Where's his daddy? Is his daddy gonna come back and get him? Hell no. Who gonna raise Makai? Girl, you better shut up. No, question you. Ho, don't question me. I ain't got autism up in here. Question yourself. She a busy body, know everybody got their business, but don't know what the fuck going on in her own damn house. She don't know shit about what's happening in her goddamn house. No, no whole question me. Whole question you. Clean your house up, hoe. Don't you ever do me. Over there kissing ass, motherfucker, don't give a fuck about her, don't even like her. Using her. But she allowed herself to be used. She walked in saying, Use me. I want to fit in. Nobody never liked me. Will y'all use me? That's you, Reed. Don't get mad at me, ho. Because I'm speaking truth. You think everybody like you on YouTube? Girl, please, these folks don't give a fuck about you. 
she think they really like her. <laughs> but really, girl. <laughs> girl, they all done drug you from here to Timbuktu. Over there kissing ass, sucking dick, and sucking puss. Girl, get the fuck up out of here. That's you. Come on, why, Kwani, why? Nah, bitch, question you. Some of them looking crazy. She's so fly. Really? A fly bitch ain't got no hair plastered towards her face. A fly bitch shows her face. Pull the hair off your face, bitch, so you can see. That's why she can't see shit. She got her in front of her face. I don't know why she had not behind her hair. She's so gorgeous. A gorgeous bitch ain't over there covering up. Now let's get real on that one, child. Why are you covering up over? You not even wearing bangs, girl. Girl, who ain't, who still wearing bangs? You don't love yourself by now? You never will. Who the fuck still wearing bangs, girl? And you not even wearing bangs, girl. You, you grabbing a whole chunk of her, flipping it across your face. Girl, you covering up, honey. A cover up ain't nothing but a lie. What you hiding? That's all hiding, girl. That's all hiding. Don't hide it, girl. Divide it. Don't hide it. Divide it. Some of some white, corny, white. No. Question yourself, girl. Question yourself. If I was a mother of a child that was special needs, I'd be concerned about that. Uh, is Kimmy over there uh, finding a cure for autism? Is that why you bought her membership? Is Joyce find a cure for autism? Is that why you over there with uh Joyce? Is Five Babe over there uh finding a cure for uh autism? Is that why you over there with uh <laughs> with uh Five Babe? And everybody else on YouTube, you know more about everybody business on here besides how to find a cure for autism. You should be over there raising that black son of yours. But no, you got your ass done by the business. But ain't bit more sitting down trying to find a cure for autism. Then you get so goddamn mixed up in the game of it all, you start telling your own business. You and your stories, I told you. I was in your room and told you that, girl, you and your stories. Well, Kwani, you know these stories are true. Yeah, but your stories need to shut up. Then they turn around and use your goddamn stories against you, your ass up on YouTube crying like a goddamn fool. These bitches do not care about you. They don't care about you. Your ass die. Your ass end up in jail. Ain't nobody gonna give a fuck about you, Makai, or your son. Your other child up in the house. Girl, please. And the reason why I don't say the other child's name because she ain't never voiced it on here. That's why I never said the other child's name because I know y'all about to say, what's the other child's name? Don't worry about it. I know his name, but I'm not saying it. She says Makai name so goddamn much. And she had no business saying that child's name either. That she be the first one crying. You start dragging. You talked about my child. You talked about my child. You call them retarded. Why are you listening? I want to go live and give y'all some tea. She know more about everything on YouTube. But less about what's going on in her own domicile. I find it sick. And demented. And the reason why she's doing it is because she wants to fit in. When Sean over there calling you all type of bag of bonds and bitches and hoes and shit. When you wrote that goddamn book. Nobody likes you when you wrote that book, girl. I was the one rooting for you when you wrote that book. And I told the rest of these hoes, write your own story. They were dragging your ass from here. Mm -mm -mm, to Venezuela. When you wrote that book. Now they all love you. Girl, please. They ain't forget about that goddamn ragged ass book you wrote, child. She really believe they forgotten. Oh, they're forgiving me about that book. Girl, please. 
You sound like a goddamn fool if you believe that. <laughs> you sound like a zip damn fool if you believe they forgot about that book that you wrote. You sound, you more stupid than I thought you were. Really, you think they forgot about that book you wrote? Girl, please. Because they say hi to you in the room and let you be in the room. Don't mean a goddamn thing. Oh, they forgiving you. Oh, not the beefing sector. Girl, they're just hanging you out to dry. They're just hanging you out to dry. Waiting on you to make one false move and they're going to gut you like a fish. So don't question me. Why, Kwani, why? No, question yourself. I don't think you know them very well. I'm the end girl. Okay. I didn't kiss ass to get where I am. I'm an OG. Don't you ever believe that you know everything because you don't. As you sit over there in Kimmy's membership and a few other memberships, don't ever think that you know everything because you don't. You think they don't realize it is like you are sitting in that room. Do you think they're telling everything while your dumb ass didn't pay for it? Child, they're giving you exactly what you need and exactly what you want. While you bring your dumb ass back here on YouTube telling us what's going on in the membership. They over there saying this, that, and the third. Yeah, they may be over there saying this, that, and the third. But believe you me, they've already worked that out behind the scenes with others. They said this, that, and the third about Jay Wilson. Mm -hmm. How about this? Jay Wilson already knew they was going to say that about him. This is how stupid you are. <laughs> Do folks not realize what folks are really giving in these Zooms, in these memberships? And I want to let you know, Shelly, that Kimmy said X, Y, and Z. Okay. Really? Hearing it from, from you, does it matter? Do you think that everybody believes it's come with everything that's coming at your face? No, don't say why, Kwani, why? Question yourself, dummy. Girl, please. <laughs> really now? She knows everything. The holy grail of the beefing sector. Really? The holy grail of the beefing sector, really? No, I know why, Kwani, why? Question yourself. Behind the scenes is much more better than being here on the scene. You wouldn't want to cry when somebody was stalking you. Not I. You were the one saying, Somebody will take your photographs of you. Once you over there just arguing with the tea lounge, saying that she didn't tell you somebody was over there taking photographs of you as you were walking to a store. That was you. So why are you questioning me? That's not my story. That story belonged to you, Reed. Now read your own book. Read your own life. I'm going off what I'm seeing here on YouTube. This is no conspiracy or no a theory. I'm going off the things that you placed here on YouTube. You got your behind in everybody's business, but not your own. Oh, that crazy you put on YouTube, honey. How do I know you're going to a room that you don't want to go to? And your family make you go to funerals to look at a caucus inside of a casket. You put that on here, I find it really weird. If you ask me, I don't know about the rest of y'all, I find it odd. Why send an idiot to do somebody else's job? I'll make that make sense. So you going all the way to a viewing of a dead person which really is a shell 
They got you going to visit a shell in a box, in a pine box for your family. And you putting that on YouTube. And you, you find that funny. You find that exuberating. Why are you telling us? What are we supposed to do? Girl, that's so fabulous. No, it's not. I find it disgusting. That don't happen over here in my uh tribe. That's not that's not my tribe. You either go to the front or you don't. And who going to everybody front? You sound you you sound like that goddamn crazy woman over there on good times. Who cries on cue and go to everybody front? And the reason why she going to all them front because she want to eat. You don't realize why that woman was going on all them front Do you not understand the character of that lady on good times? Let's talk about the, the character on good times. Remember that character on good times, that old lady who cried on cue and went to everybody front room. Would even show places that she thought somebody was dead. The reason why she did that, that woman had nothing to eat. She was hungry. She was there for the repast. She wasn't there because she cared about the dead bitch. She was there because she wanted to eat food. You don't even understand the character, bitch. <laughs> Let's get real. Is that what you're doing? Uh, your, is your mama sending you out to go get repast food? To bring back to the tribe? They too late to go grab some plates and put aluminum foil on some goddamn Dixie cups and Dixie plates if they're really Dixie, bitch. But anyway, I digress. Are they over there got you gathering up food to bring back to the nest? You put that on YouTube, honey. I didn't make that up. That's on your videos. You just talked about Makai the other day. I removed his Instagram because he was Instagramming all the girls in his class asking what they doing every five minutes, what they eating and all that. Why do we need to know that? Why are you telling us what your child, your autistic child is doing? And then cry if somebody used that against you. Now, ain't nobody didn't tap into your life. You tapped into your own life and put it on YouTube. You said that, and I told my cat he was creepy for doing that. For starters, you don't have your son. You live with him. You didn't realize he does not deserve outside resources unless it's beneficial you don't realize that social media is the devil why would you put your child autistic son on social media to be able to be creepy with others now them girls go back to that damn school and tell on Makai then what But no, you got your ass as his mother on YouTube telling us. And the same way folks are calling in on uppity, somebody start calling in on you, dummy. Because you talk too much. Because you talk entirely too much. You know, good and damn well, this ain't nothing but a cesspool of folks who can't stand one another. So don't get mad at me, bitch, because I'm trying to help your dumb ass. Now, somebody start calling CPS on you and your goddamn mothering. Well, lack of mothering skills. Don't get mad at me. I'm warning you, ho. Your dumb ass. Now, I'll question you, idiot. Kimmy ain't got no children over there or no autistic children in her house. Stalking little girls at school. You do. Kimmy mama ain't making her go see dead caucus in a pine box 
for food, for victuals. That's you. Now question you. You gonna let some goddamn melty face hole do me with no teeth? Hey, get the fuck out of here, bitch. Who didn't stole from a damn job? Girl, please, you thief. Get your ass up out here stealing from a goddamn job. The police and the FBI had to show up and HIPAA had to show up at your house. The CDC showed up at your goddamn mama house looking for you. Girl, you better back up and make shirts down in the goddamn basement next to that boiler to the internet who don't work too long and for the 5% of your phone. Girl, please. You could be the reason that AT&T and T-Mobile went down yesterday. <laughs> Wasn't my goddamn phone. <laughs> that was just your shit. You could be the reason all the shit that went down. All you get is 5%. No, ain't no why, Kwani, why? No, bitch, question you. Y'all shit went down because of her damn cell phone won't stay activated properly. Her goddamn shit fucked up over there. Why your internet service over there janky? Still in somebody else's Wi-Fi? Much? Ain't playing no goddamn read. Read a book, girl. Read a book and find a cure for autism. Y'all let that hole over there. I know. Y'all let that hole over Y'all know she over there doxing folks. Now, how she, how did she know that was Johnny Mac name? Oh, we gonna overlook that too, huh? We gonna overlook. It was Reed knew that was Johnny Mac name. How did Reed know that was Johnny Mac name? What did you do? Did you dox Johnny Mac? Nobody ain't talking about that now, are they? Remember when Susie came live and told that story and she said the name, it was called Maddie's something. Maddie, Maddie's Boy Entertainment. And she asked who? Who did she ask? Reed? How did Reed know that Matt, who Maddie's boy was? Y'all ain't talking about that now, all y'all. Uh, Johnny Mac, you didn't know you were doxxed? Now that would admit that Reed had doxxed you, right? How would anybody on YouTube know who the fuck Maddie's boy was? Mm. Y'all forgot over there. Y'all forget that. Y'all just overlooked all of that now, didn't you, Sean Bradley? Y'all so damn smart around here, but yet so stupid. How did Reed know who the fuck Maddie's boy entertainment was? When they had meant she had already doxed Johnny Mac? Mm. Isn't that something? Isn't that something? Really? But she all up in Sean's room loving on put upon Sean, but she had already dodged Johnny Mac now, didn't she? Who the fuck is Maddie's boy entertainment? How would Reed know that information? Wouldn't they admit she had doxed him? Mm. I digress on that one. <laughs> Honey, how would she know that? Because Susie stated when she looked up that trademark that was attached to Firebase. It said Maddie's Boy Entertainment. It didn't say Johnny Mac from YouTube. It said Maddie's Boy Entertainment. How would Reed know who the fuck Maddie's Boy was unless she had doxxed it? My God, today. My mind is telling me no. But my body, my body says that because Johnny Mac got doxxed. Right? Mm-hmm. Y'all not talking about the real shit. Y'all not talking about the real shit around here. Who docks Johnny Mac? How would you know who the fuck Maddie's boy entertainment was? It didn't say Johnny Mac from YouTube. That's a test the club chat and a side eyes and Sean Bradley. Now did it. Who docks Johnny Mac? How in the fuck would you know who the fuck Maddie's boy entertainment was? That would have meant you had doxxed them. Y'all forgot all that, now didn't y'all? Mm -hmm. I didn't forget about it. When I heard that, I said, mm. 
Sound like somebody over there got docs. Sound like doxation to me. If it shows up, the trademark that's been purchased is under Maddie's Boy Entertainment. How would you know it belonged to Johnny Mac? In order to find that out, you got to dox Maddie's Boy Entertainment, right? You got to look into Maddie's Boy Entertainment, which meant that Johnny Boy, well, Johnny Mac, is his mama named Maddie? See how that works? Are all y'all this stupid? I know I cannot be the, the only bitch on here with vision and purpose. Now who dots Maddie's boy? Entertainment. Hmm? If Susie said she didn't, the caller, who she called, did she call Reed? According to Reed, Reed said she was the one that was called. Well, that would have meant that Reed had doxxed Johnny Mac. Mm, okay. No, don't whine me, bitch. Question yourself, you and your doxation over there, who always been lying for years, telling you ain't doxing nobody. You ain't dox nobody. Oh, yes, you did. You've been doxing, girl. You doxed Lady P and gave me all Lady P information. And you doxed Rick Reed and gave me all Rick Reed's information. So stop that lying, ho. Now get on over there and dox autism. And fix that. Don't question me, bitch. Question you. Ain't no why, Kwani, why. No, you asking why because I'm on your ass again. Because you over there being stupid. And now all fingers are pointing back at you because your ass over there doxing people again. How would you know who the fuck Maddie's boy entertainment belonged to? That would admit you at the doxing. Girl, you don't know who that is. That's Johnny Mac. Oh, of course it's Johnny Mac because you, you went and doxed it. Susie told your story, girl. Susie told that on her channel. She got it over there on members only. But Susie told that. Mm -hmm. And I was there watching it. Sure was. Right there listening. I said, oh, somebody doxed Maddie's boy entertainment. The trademark is under Maddie's boy entertainment. It's not under Johnny Mac. Y'all didn't get that? I got it. So that would mean you went and doxed Maddie's boy entertainment. And it led you back to Johnny Mac. Which meant you dug a little deeper. Mm. But yet you over there playing in Sean room. Really? But see, Sean don't care. Sean ain't fond of you, chat. And right now, what's, what, what's going on is feasible for Sean Bradley because he don't like Five Bay. The thing is, he hates Five Bay more than he hates you, Reed. That's all that's going on. He despises Five Bay more than he despises you, Reed the Heart of Philadelphia. Now, as you call yourself Reed the Heart of Philadelphia, why don't you read in the room? You got autism too? Why aren't you reading the room unless you got autism as well? You don't understand social cues? Maybe you don't understand social cues. That's a part of autism too. That's under the umbrella as well. Not understanding social cues. Don't question me about why, Kwani, why, no, nah, bitch. Question you. The ass kisser that you are to fit in with folks who don't give a fuck about you. Your ass gonna be gone some goddamn where. And who gonna raise Makai? It won't be Susie. It won't be Bradley. It won't be nobody on YouTube. All the ones you saying hello to in your room. Really, they're gonna say, we pray for the family. And that's all they're going to be giving. Don't question me, girl. I was there for you when nobody was there for you, chair. And we'll also curse you out. 
Honey, you, honey, I told you any hoe can get it. Any hoe can get it. You are not invincible, bitch. You are not immortal. Now, maybe you may be trying to be, but honey, mm-mm. Mm-mm. Yeah, I saw it about why, Kwani, why? First, learn how to say words correctly. It's called nosy. Not newsy. Nosy. People are being nosy. You have a nose. What you call your nose? That, that appendage on your face in the middle, it's called a nose. Or you call that a news? It's called nosy. Putting your nose in somebody's business and you being nosy, not newsy. It's another word you pronounce wrong, too. I don't find it funny. I find it disgusting. She around here laying down making babies. She around here getting fucked and sucking on dick and shit and can't pronounce words correctly. And y'all not laughing at that? How she writing books and can't pronounce words? What type of author is this? Really not? <laughs> she writing books and shit. <laughs> but can't pronounce words correctly? That appendage that sits right there in the middle of your face is called a nose. The word is called nosy because you're putting your nose in everybody's business. You being nosy. It's not called newsy. It's called nosy. And what's that other word she says wrong? And it irritates me. But she's so goddamn nosy and everybody goddamn busy but can't even pronounce words correctly. What in the fucking do it decimal system did she come from in Philly? I hope they burnt that school down and burnt all the books. All her damn words over there mispronouncing grown and shit. Wait a minute, what about she and everybody business? But paying for everybody's uh, membership. I want to go live and tell you what Kimmy said. Do we care? Why would we care what Kimmy's saying? When Kimmy over there serving y'all up with truth and lies, you think Kimmy putting everything over there? Really? You think Sean Brody putting everything over on them Zooms and shit? Hell no, because he know y'all paying for it. He, they are feeding the masses. Y'all are dumb to even believe that they're giving you nothing but truth in them rooms. When everybody goes over there and buy it and steal it. You are dumb to believe they are really giving you Facts upon facts upon facts. They know that you dumb motherfuckers are over there stealing their shit. Really now? Really now? Really? If you really believe they are really over there on those memberships telling you all nothing but truth over there. If they lying to us, you know, gun goddamn what they lying over there. You got to keep it interesting. This here is entertainment and their job is to entertain, even though if entertainment turns into bad. You think they don't know they stuff being stolen and putting over their own list again? A lot of the time, they are playing up for Lipstick Alley. Do you not un even understand that, dummy? They know good and damn well Lipstick Alley has bought everybody's damn membership. At least somebody from Lipstick Alley has bought it. And go right over to Lipstick Alley and post it over there. And you really believe that everybody's going over to their memberships and telling their members everything. All the juicy parts. Really? So Re can come back to YouTube and tell us? Girl, please. And then you come back and tell shit wrong. You will fuck up a telephone game. Remember the telephone game that we played when we were three to five years of age? For some of y'all, maybe six. The teacher tells a, st tells a word. To one student and it goes all around the classroom and get back to the teacher is a whole totally different word. 
the teacher said house. And by the time it get back to her, they saying car. My God, today. All right, y'all. That's all I got to say. But now I'll read, honey. Ain't no damn quantity. Why quantity? Mm -mm. No, question yourself. Why you and your lies and why you over there doxing Johnny Mac? Why you on here telling Makai business? Why are you telling your family business? No, why you? Why are you kissing the ass of motherfuckers who don't give a fuck about you? Why are you are allowing yourself to be used? See, they're not using you. You lay it there on the floor and let them walk all over you like a doormat. Now, why that? Why are you going live 5,000 times a day when your ass should be over there figuring out how to maneuver around autism? How to fix autism, how to find a cure for autism, and where did it start? And how did your child end up with it? Why your child? And not any of mine. Now figure that out. Now why autism? Why autism? Why autism? Why? Don't question me, bitch. Question you. All right, that's all I got. And I ain't got no more. You got to me playing this chair. Over there lying and, and alibi and on live 50, 11 times a day. And Big Mo took that child no damn word. Her and that baby ain't been no goddamn work because she going live 50, 11 times a day. Ain't never took a break from YouTube. Ain't never been on no damn vacation with that child. How long she been on YouTube? How many years that girl been on YouTube? Ain't been no goddamn with them children. No, why you ain't been on vacation with Makai? Why all Makai know is inside that house? As you on YouTube 50, 11 times a day. Worried about what the fuck Kimmy doing on her goddamn members only and everybody else members only. Worried about what the fuck Susie doing, Sean doing, Fabe doing, Joyce doing, and many others. Now, why, nigga, why? Now, question you. Why, nigga, why? Why you ain't taking Macau on vacations? To the zoo? The art museum? Why would you elevate it, Mackay? All Mackay knows is you gave him Instagram and then removed it. No, don't question me, bitch. I leave my domicile. I know how to log the fuck off. I go on vacations. And I ain't got to save autism. Because we ain't got any over here all right y'all i'm done <laughs> y'all enjoy y'all day it's the weekend baby and i'm gonna have me a fabulous weekend i'll be 53 and we're gonna rock out we're gonna rock it out in this leap year too we are leap year in this year Yes, we are this month, honey. We are leap year in, bitch. Yes, we are. Leap year in around here. I don't know why she over there upset. Because I told the truth. The truth hurts, doesn't it? I don't know why the truth hurts, bitch. The truth is here to save you, girl. The truth is here to save you. Now, you were just crying about somebody stalking you and the t Lives didn't tell you. And why didn't the t Lives tell me? Somebody was taking photographs of me while I was walking down the street and going to the store and buying candies. That was you. That was not I. All right, now. Moderators, I love you and adore you. Everybody that came in the room, love you and adore you as well. Enjoy your weekend. Be safe. Be loving to yourselves and loving to others. Wear your mask and utilize your sanitizers. Utilize your sanitizers. All right, you all. Ta-ta for now. Ta-ta.